So I had a little trouble with the engine here. It was idling kind of rough. And uh, when you open the when you open the hood and listen to the engine run, you could kind of hear a little hissing noise, which I didn't know was not normal. When I talked to the mechanic down the street, but uh, basically. There's some vacuum hoses in here that have elbows in them that go bad. They implode on themselves and let air in. Ultimately, letting more air into the intake, causing it to run a little bit lean and idle poorly. It even cut out a few times on me. Uh, I replaced one of them. Uh, let's see if we can see it here. It's in there. It's, uh, you can see the, the black PVC looking hose that attaches to an elbow that goes up into the, into the intake manifold. It's the one all the way in the back there, and it runs all the way to the back, uh, connects into the engine block back there. It's, su it's super difficult to get to. But anyways, I had not one but two of those things go bad on me, and uh, after fixing the first one, I didn't really notice that the second one was bad until I opened it up today to put some oil in it, and heard that hissing noise again. Uh, it's pretty distinctive. You shouldn't hear anything but, uh, but a uh, rocker and valve noises when this thing runs, besides the fan, obviously. And, uh... Yeah, the other one's located way in the back. It's um it's connected to this thing. I don't know. It's really difficult to get to. You have to look up a, a diagram or take it to the dealership. They'll show you an exploded view of it. But they didn't have they didn't even have this one in the diagram. It's weird. There's some kind of a uh, some kind of solenoid, a vacuum activated solenoid in the back of this uh, manifold all the way in the back corner. All the way back there. But that's the difficult part about this job is you can't reach any of it. Maybe with one hand and super inconveniently. But anyways, I replaced both of those and uh, if you have two of them go bad, you can probably use the same front one here two times. Uh, I used a different one that they had in stock, but I managed to make it work. That solved my problem. There's two vacuum hose elbows. Replace those and you should be good to go. Hopefully this video helped you.